Lifestyle on Wheels is brought to you by... The views and opinions expressed by the host and the guests do not necessarily reflect the show or the network. For your comments and suggestions, you may email us at motorcyclingnewsmagazine at gmail.com. Good afternoon to our viewers. My name is Tyran and welcome to Lifestyle on Wheels. episodes we have our news and events the Ducati Monster Day we also have the 10th year anniversary of the Soul Riders we have the Honda Scooter Fest and the unveiling of the Honda Click 150i for our motorcycle news segment we have the Suzuki Raider Summit 2017 Supremacy and of course for our car side we have the fourth preseason drivers briefing we also have driven to ride hosted by Joey Storm Rivero. And for our motorism segment, we have the Laia Day 2, of course, brought to you by Ride Along Motorcycle Tours Philippines. So, tell the viewers, just stick around and enjoy the show. Ngayon naman, matutunghayan natin ang Driven to Ride ni Mr. Joey Storm. Kaya Joey, take it away. Guys, check out my ride for this weekend. Yep, it's the BMW F700. Tamang tama pang long ride. I've been to a lot of places around the country kung saan saan na ako nakarating. No? And it's about time na isama ko naman kayo sa amin. Tara, samahan niyo ako. Destination Bataan. My home province, the historic Bataan, lies at the westernmost peninsula of the Central Luzon region. It is bordered by the province of Zambales, city of Alongapo, SBMA, and Pampanga. No? To get there, of course, you can use the North Luzon Expressway and SETEX. Pwede rin gamitin yung Lumang Kalsada, yung MacArthur Highway, and via the Olonga Poga Pan Road. No? It will take you approximately around siguro mga an hour and a half to get to uh, Bataan no? uh, using uh, the Dinalupihan na uh, exit at SETEX or uh, via San Fernando Pampanga. Or you can also use uh, get through Subic. No, uh, kung galing ka na Subic, you can use the back door, which will bring you to Morong, no, the western uh, side ng Bataan, no, which has really great uh, beaches and a lot of uh, places that you can uh, go to. Dito sa Morong, there are a lot of interesting places that you can go to, no. Siyempre, lahat kilala na yung Anvaya Cove, pero hindi lang yon. May beaches and most importantly, yung Bata BTPI, no? yung Bataan Techno Park. Ano yung Bataan Techno Park? Yung Bataan Techno Park actually was the former Philippine Refugee Center, no? Processing Center. So, nung mga gera dati sa Vietnam and Cambodia, dito uh, dinala or dito pumunta yung mga na-dislocate na mga Asian brothers natin. So, tignan natin kung anong meron dito sa sa uh, former uh, refugee processing center which is really very rich in culture. So actually, BTP traces its history as the site of the Philippine Refugee Processing Center or the PRPC, a temporary resettlement for the Indo-Chinese refugees from 1980 to 1994. Uh, this boat, I nagdang to talaga mismo dito sa Bataan Shore, sa isang barangay sa Morong sa Mabayo. Noong May, May 12, 1981, so napakatagal na niya. 65 ang nakasakay dito, so almost 35 yung bawat isang boat na nang dumating dito, lahat ay survivors. So mamaya, uh, makita nyo yung uh, Indo-Chinese shrines and monuments, yung ginawa ng Vietnamese, na Buddhist temple, yung ginawa nilang uh, Vietnamese temple, yung sa Khmer naman is yung the four-headed Bayon temple, at saka yung Angkor Wat, tapos yung Laotian, meron silang tatluang monument. Talaga naman pinupuntahan dito sa Morong, no, itong Hu Chu, no, at saka yung Ban Mi, no. These are uh, Cambodian, Vietnamese uh, noodles and uh, sandwiches, no. Na dalawa ang kilala, na original na gumagawa nito, at isa yung pinuntahan ko ngayon, yung Aling Solis, yung isa yung 
ng uh, aling lolengs no etong morong kilala din sa mga beaches niya no? imagine mo isang mahabang sandbar along the morong coast nandito rin yung ano yung uh, pawikan conservation na uh, center no dito sa bataan kung saan uh, inaalagaan natin yung mga endangered pawikan no yung sea turtles dito alam mo dito sa morong uh, yung mga sea turtles they come in you know they lay their eggs here sa sandbars na to dito and then uh, itong uh, mga taga pawikan center kinukuha nila yung eggs sina hatch nila no and then they yung hatchlings they return it may releasing into the sea ba sabi nila kapit mura kung saan nakatira ang tao eh makikilala muna ako sino siya kung gusto nyo siguro makilala ang Filipino people no pinakamaganda kung masyal po tayo dito sa Pilipinas di ako sa akin you will see a lot of old houses no totoong ano old houses restored no historic with the historical background no even yung alam mo yun yung kung saan ginawa yung scene ng General Luna na andito so this is one place that you'd love to go no parang time machine pagpunta mo dito you go back in time magandang hapon po sa ating lahat sa lahat po ng mga bikers, riders, weekend warriors, mga bakasyonista, pasyalan nyo po kami dito sa Bataan. We're just a stone throw away from Metro Manila at sigurado pong mag -e enjoy kayo. A visit to Bataan spawns a tale of many journeys. Hello guys. Alam mo, kahit san-san ka na nang galing, no? galing ka na North Luzon, uh, sa Visayas, or sa Mindanao, iba pa rin yung sarili mong bayan. No? Iba pa rin yung pakiramdam. You know, there's no place like home. Yep, walang tatalo sa feeling ng tatapusin mo yung araw mo dito sa ibabaw ng bataan. Walang iba kundi sa Mount Samat. So guys, I hope you enjoyed our uh, feature for Destination Bataan. And uh, we look forward to seeing you here. Pasyalan nyo po ang aming probinsya. Definitely, there are a lot of adventures, activities, and places that you can visit. So, tara na po. Again, this is Joey Storm Rivero and you're watching Driven to Ride. Thank you so much, Papa Joey Storm Rivero. Talaga namang very informative ang iyong segment. Sana naman next time, ako naman ang ma-invite mo dyan. Magkita-kita tayo ulit next week. Dito lang sa People's Television Network. Every Saturday, 2.30 in the afternoon. So bagong lahat, nais nice namin munang pasalamatan ang aming mga sponsors. And of course, kung hindi nyo pa nilalike ang aming mga social media pages, ilike nyo na sila. And of course, kung meron kayong mga comments and suggestions, Huwag kayong mag-atubili, mag-email lang sa amin sa motorcyclenewsmagazine at gmail.com At kung hindi nyo pa napapanood ang aming mga previous episodes, pumunta lang kayo sa aming website www.motorcyclenews.com And there you have it guys! On behalf of Joel Hoya, I'm Tyron Hawk and this is your number one mooring lifestyle show on TV. Lifestyle on Wheels! And mga guys, wala po maglilipat ang channel sa inyo. Magsama-sama-sama at magsama-sama-sama. 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 Kusina. Ang aking tambayan. Kusina. Ngayon naman, ipapakinaan naman sa inyo. Pinapakulong naman. Okay. Game na ba? Oo. Ganto kami dito pag nauuhaw. Inom ka! Inom ka! Pag nauuhaw. Pamugas ang paa. Ayan. Ano may init? Ayos warm water. Inom ka! Inom ka! Lifestyle on Wheels is brought to you by